Hello guys and welcome back to a new video, the BMW 8 series or series 8, uh, the way you want to call it, 2020, it's right here with me and I will review it for you, interior, exterior, and I try to show you as many as detailed as possible. Uh, I have to tell you, this is one of my favorite uh, cabriolet cars on the market uh, in 2020 and it's gorgeous really gorgeous look at these rims uh, they look so so nice on the car um, we have here i think if i'm not wrong uh, 20 inch rims yes exactly 20 inch rims and we have the sport brake calipers the m sport brake calipers on the car they look fabulous even the led lights in the back look gorgeous we have full led on the car uh, six parking sensors in the back on the back bumper the back bumper it's fabulous look at the design look at the lines guys look at this gray glossy with the exhaust pipe we have some fake exhaust pipe and then inside there we have the reels one here we have some plastic uh design plastic lines also the the red light reflectors um for the night reverse camera led lights on the number plate um really beautiful design uh, i think it's the most beautiful uh, cabriolet this new 8 series cabriolet is the most most beautiful um in this class in my opinion uh, i li i really like it <clears throat> And I think the the bumper and I think the LED lights make all the money. It's so beautiful, so nice design. Even the blinkers look fantastic there. Uh, you can see the shape there. It's kind of a three-dimensional shape. Even up here on the trunk um, gate looks so, so nice. Also, the brake light, really. Um, the brake light in the middle there. Uh, I, we will see it in the moment but really nice nice lines here here's the brake light that i'm told you uh it looks really nice really the back of the car look fantastic now we will go up here they make also some lines on the on the trunk there uh and then tell me what you think guys i'm really curious uh which one is your favorite cabriolet a car in 2020 also here around uh, these edges we have glossy black plastic that go all the way there also here very good quality leather you can see uh, also here with the stitches white stitches there very good quality um, on the on the roof there um, also uh, all the way to the door it's go this glossy plastic uh, around the car there now let me go in the front to show you the rest uh, the blinkers led lights on the mirrors as well um, they look so beautiful down there we have the camera you can see the camera right there because this cam this car have 360 degrees camera it have this new system um, that you can park the car or you can see three dimensional around the car uh, so it's very very easy to park the car um, also the mirrors look nice some glossy plastic around them there we have the blind spot technology on the mirror you can see the triangle there some glossy plastic also on the um on the body of the car there around the windshield uh, on the side we have some plastic glossy here uh, that make the car look much more um sportier and aggressive uh, give a little bit of, of of taste to the car here are the information about the car if you're interested 840d x drive cabriolet this is the new 8 series uh, 3 liter engine we have uh, 320 horsepower there the price of this car it's 157 thousand dollars the ground price for this car it's 136 thousand uh, dollars this is the new starting price um also plus option the price will be bigger um 7.5 this is consumption um of the of this very powerful engine and now we will go in the front and i will show you the um, the led lights right here with the new technology from bmw laser led light 
Uh, you can see also here on the side, it said BMW Laser. Those are the most new technology. Six parking sensors in the front as well. Beautiful bumper in the front, guys. Really, really nice design with the lines there and all that fancy features. There, the air go on the side of the car for a better aerodynamic. Um, they just design it like that. Uh, that help a lot with the consumption and also the the handling on the road here we have a big hole where the air go inside and if you look careful inside there you, you will see on the other side that the air go there in and it go outside around the wheels actually they go directly to the brake disc where they uh, cool down a little bit the brake disc uh, when you're driving really fast uh, that air will go to the wheels there, to the brake disc and calipers, and they help a little bit uh, with the heat. Uh, so great, great system there. Also, as you see on the other side, the brake calipers are M Sports, um, the, the really very good quality. Also nice aerodynamic on the bumper. Here in the middle, we have the radar for adaptive cruise control, emergency brake, and all that new features. Then the grill that go the air directly to the engine and on the other side the same same story uh, as I told you there and also beautiful lines here also some rubber here to protect the down part of the car while you're driving for little stones and stuff like that. The front grill glossy black plastic uh, look also nice like the M uh, models. Also um the hood look beautiful with those lines they take a lot of things from the m models and bring it to this new 8 series you can see the front camera here uh, right in the middle of the grill the clappers are now close to the grill uh, if you can look carefully but they they will open automatic when the engine is very hot they will open and they will let so much more air inside to go to the engine so that's uh, the new system, new technology from BMW. Uh, and I like the, the all that feature, the bumper, the grill, um, and all that feature that they take it from the M Sport, from the Sport versions, also the brake discs and the caliper. You can see it here. Also, the rims are for M. Uh, they, they are the light aluminum rims. So uh, also they help the... Uh, the car weight to be a little bit uh, less so uh, a lot of new tech on the car also the leasing it's pretty awesome these days just 0 0.9 it's pretty good up there we have the cameras for lane assist we have the, the raining sensors uh, there is the camera for reading the traffic speed limit and all that uh, new tech also we will go inside the car now um, to show you the interior as well but this this back of the car just just make me crazy it looks so nice the car looks so beautiful um really really beautiful design it's just my opinion i don't know what you think guys but in my opinion it is a fantastic car great design really beautiful what uh, what can i say i just think it's it's one of the most beautiful in this class and if not in my opinion the best one anyway the mercedes have also this uh, cabriolet that look gorgeous but yeah i don't know i don't know i like this design exterior design much better uh, also let let me close the the blinkers let me show you the interior and we will start with the back seat also here on the side we have very good quality uh, up here we have leather, we have the seat belt that are M um, Sport, also leather, very good quality, even down there, everywhere they work on every detail and they make uh, a great, great job, great quality um, around everywhere. Also the seats are leather seats, very good quality as well and they also very comfortable because the leather, it's a little bit soft. You can see the same design on the seats like you see it on the uh, brothers. They are so comfortable. I think BMW, they find this combination between the 
sport and comfortable seats because sometimes you have too much comfort you don't have sportiness and when you have too much sportiness you don't have comfort for long trips but those seats um from bmw that's why they keep the shape because um, they find a great great combination balance between those also we have ventilated um, heat rester right there so that's quite impressive and also ventilated seats you can see the bmw individual those seats are make individual and really special very good quality leather uh, they last very long in time they, they, you will not see here around the, the uh, edges of the seats no uh, no wearing uh, in time you will have to to pass years and years to see some wearing on those seats so I have to tell you, heated seat, uh, ventilated seat on this BMW, electric seat adjustable in every position. Uh, very simple from down here. Also, we have aluminum pedals. Also, take it from the M. They look also nice. Here we have some aluminum with M logo. Also, you can see carbon writing right there. A lot of parts from this car are made from carbon. You know, carbon fiber, it's much more lighter and, and a lot of parts are made from carbon and then this helps the, the weight of the car to be less and help the car to go much faster and have a better um, handling on the road. The doors quality also fantastic. You can see the buttons for the saving position. You can see those speakers from Bowers and Wilkins. You find this on the Volvo, you know, BMW have also a collaboration with them and they come with this beautiful, beautiful, I think those are the most beautiful uh, speakers uh, that I see in a car. I know Volvo collaborate as well and Mercedes as well. I see it on them. So um, those are some of the, the best uh, speakers and they also look great in this uh, aluminum um, like that super glossy everywhere soft material and leather you can see up there and everywhere on the doors a lot of space here the button for opening the trunk there uh, in the back and yeah in my opinion plenty plenty of space uh, of good quality inside this car even the price it's it's so big but a lot of great great materials uh, in the car that deserve the price you can see now the seat is going automatic in the front to make some space for you to go there in the back now here we have carpet everywhere uh soft material the seat you already see it leather seat behind the, the front seat we have some uh, rubber kind of rubber here we have the isofix even for kids you can have the kids here in the back leather in the middle uh part right there and even here in the back we have leather and good quality uh, materials uh, we have a speaker as well right here in the back uh, and then uh, here we have some plastic and then up there we have leather really uh, the same leather as you find it on the front door um, with the white stitches and it's a little bit a tent of blue like that yeah fabulous really nice also when you put the seats back it will go in the position automatic uh, all the way back there so you can save the position of the seat uh, the way you want it you can customize it here in the f f middle middle console also very good quality leather on the armrest white stitches uh, some chrome design insertion uh, the dashboard look fabulous uh, in my opinion and we'll go inside wow they feel so nice those seats they are super comfortable also great visibility on the mirrors um, they are big and nice also up here good quality materials uh, we have a LED light and the mirror up here then we have uh, these LED lights with some glossy black buttons SOS button as well up there then we have the mirror, uh, beautiful mirror. I like those mirrors with uh, skinny edges like this one here. You can see the the edges are really, really tiny. Uh, 
and also you have a great visibility on the windscreen the car have also the head-up display here in the front uh, good quality on the dashboard as well here you can adjust the steering wheel um, electrically from this stick right here so the car have um, electric um, adjustable steering wheel so you can see right here um, how easy it is to adjust this steering wheel super super simple anyway uh, great great quality on the dashboard here are the vents uh, chrome design uh, the vents look also super nice Here are the button for the lights. Those are the new button uh, to open the headlamps, also the fog light, and also the brightness of the interior ambient light. Um, great quality on the dashboard. I will show you a little bit later how cool is the ambient light inside this car. Uh, it is really great. They did a great job and I know the Mercedes are the best with the ambient light inside, but BMW did a great job with ambient light. And, and also, you can see here the ambient light is also on the center console. We have a line of LED light with blue. Also, there, right here, it's soft material everywhere. Uh, soft material even on the glow box. Here, the glow box, it's, it's uh, yeah, quite, quite big enough for uh, a cabriolet car also you can see there on the door the led lights insertion um, and also the way they integrate the dashboard with the doors look very good also the position of driving it's awesome great visibility the car have the new system um, e-drive 7 that it's really good the m the new m steering wheel with heated steering wheel also you can see the leather here in the middle stitches a great great steering wheel one of the best on the market for sure uh, and one of my favorite also here on the side you can change different settings right there on the uh, cockpit digital cockpit and also here the adaptive cruise control and some safety features clappers for changing the gear manually with this stick right there, I think you see it now. You can change what you would like to see on the right side of the of the cockpit. So you can you have some option to adjust the widgets there in the right side. In the middle of, of the screen, it's usually navigation. And in the left side, usually the driving information like the speed the, and all other um, traffic uh, speed limits sign and all that stuff in the middle there you have a camera that can read your face your eyes and that can tell if you're tired or uh yeah they will they will give you some information on the screen that you have to take a break and stuff like that also here is the new multimedia system one of the best really big big enough great screen um, very very responsive great hardware and software behind it uh, one of the best in the market for sure it's very complex you have a lot of info here you can see the weather you can see also the news on it um, you can see here the consumption of the car and all that information about the last trips that you take with the car also you can go into detail here and see if the car have a problem with tires with uh, when you have to make the service here are some information about the, the security and uh, safety systems the doors you can change the settings on the doors the lights and i don't want to go into detail because i already made a full review with the new uh, e-drive 7 multimedia system from bmw check out on my channel if you want to see the full review with it uh, and also here guys uh, you can see the apps uh, I will go really fast through all these details. Also, you can create a username um, on the car. Also, um, here you can connect your phone. Uh, media, you know already. Uh, telephone, Bluetooth, screen mirroring. Also, uh, Spotify, you can have it right here uh, on your car. 
because the car can connect to the internet and the navigation system as i told you it's gorgeous gorgeous one of the best you have all kind of info there and he's working really really fast it's respond uh, really fast to all the the information so settings here on the car display you can choose the head-up display for example i want to show you the head-up display also one of the best is directly on the windscreen so it's it's one of the best one you can see it right there i don't know if you can see it so well but it's right there in the middle so you can see when i adjust it up and down so you can make an idea the way it looks it looks really good and when you're driving being inside the car it's it is very helpful also you can choose what you like to see yeah anyway um what i would like to show you more so the navigation uh down here you can you can control the navigation also with the controllers down there you can see it has the new system uh, of controllers down there so it's pretty simple to control it and very easy and also while you're driving it's it's recommended to use those controllers from the center console it's much better than uh, using the touchscreen uh, it's it's it, it let you look on the on the road in the same time so uh, that that will be a great great uh, thing also i want to show you how fast this navigation can load a destination so i put a uh, destination there and you will see like in no time it's it, it loading so that means the car has a great fast hardware behind it uh, and this hardware it's, it's really intelligent because it's loading very fast uh, the destinations and also uh, it's very responsive there are the buttons the shortcut buttons this is the new controller uh, it looks very fancy and very nice in my opinion um, and yeah anyway uh, going forward armrest is perfect just no words for it a lot of space here in the middle you have a new USB-C 12 volt board down there also an LED light so plenty of space here in the middle uh, to put your stuff. Then uh, the center console look fabulous. We have LED light up here and another LED light down there around the center console. So a lot of LED light inside this car. Um, the, the car look fabulous in the night. You can see the LED, it's even in the speakers, guys. Uh, that's really impressed me and that's why I said that this car can beat uh, the Mercedes uh, in the interior of the um, of the ambient light I mean only the ambient light it is gorgeous in the night it looks fantastic so let me show you again here LED and then we have right now on the speaker uh, and also on the doors but in the speakers they have also kind of design there you can see how nice design it has on the upper speaker and on the down speaker uh, it's quite impressive on the camera i cannot catch so good uh, those lights but trust me when you are inside the car um, your eyes can see that much better and you can make an idea uh, of how cool is that ambient light it's it's really gorgeous I have to tell you it looked phenomenal beautiful also let me go here fast to the car to, sh to change the color because you can change the ambient light color from here let me change the color and let me choose another one you can see when you change the color it's changed also the green it's it's changed the green uh, the speakers as well the color or violet for example you can change it and you can see the, the colors change I cannot see it so well, but yeah, because of the camera. Uh, but trust me, in real, it looks fabulous. And red, right now, on the red, you can see better. Or orange, it looks super, super nice. And also, all the all the light uh, inside the car is changing. All the ambient light. Uh, it's really beautiful. Really, really beautiful. I like that. Super. 
Uh, I like that a lot. So anyway, um, the stick stick is the, one of the newest is from BMW. You can see the eight there in the middle. It's super super fancy and gla glossy, like a diamond. Uh, it looks beautiful, really beautiful, and also um, it's easy to use. It's like a finger. It's small. We have here the glossy plastic with the buttons uh for the seats here are the vents up there also ventilated uh, this is for the passenger this is for the driver and then we have the parking brakes then we have the adaptive echo comfort sport you change different modes of driving every time you change the mode of driving it's changed also the screen color and the multimedia uh, system colors so uh, quite awesome then we have the start stop button also kind of a glossy like a glass you can see it look like a glassy and um, look very nice and also the buttons here for the parking sensors and the cameras around the car and all that uh, nice stuff so you can see here that um, you can uh, watch uh, around the car so because the, the car have uh, cameras around it you can go to 3d and you can watch around the car what happened because yeah i show you before the cameras around the car so you are still able to to look around the car uh, without any problem so go to 3d and you can see here uh, where the car is and what's around the car and it will help you very very easily to uh, to park the car and to drive in 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 small places so anyway uh, i hope you make an idea uh, about that i love these three dimensional cameras they are really really fancy and um, really great system down here we have the um, in the vents guys and also down here we have two cup holders and usb port um, you can put here your stuff also you can charge your phone wireless down there uh, and you can also close this if you want to keep it close you can leave it close like that uh, and you can see how beautiful look this center console uh, with all that design and also up here we have the media um with this button it's a little bit different but other than that all other buttons glossy plastic they look nice uh, here we have the ventilated seat also heated seat guys uh, you can change and adjust the speed and the van and the fan and the way you want it also um the seat i showed you before they have little holes uh, that help the air come in much better and also here we have a little screen right here in the middle for the climatic system when when you can adjust the the temperature inside the car inside the cabin it's very very simple to to work with it and also it has the newest systems so um this is the newest is um climatic systems also i like those buttons because those buttons have some ambient light inside them i don't know if you can see it so well but uh, they look fancy also the vents they feel good quality when you touch it and they look very nice up there we have the blinker button and then another button right here on the right side is the, the this is the button that can let you turn on all the security system or make it individual or turn it off uh, from that button and also uh i think it looked fabulous i think they did a great job with the center console the steering wheel it's awesome also the handles the the uh even the speakers look gorgeous in my opinion and what can i say uh in my opinion um this is the most uh, beautiful um cabriolet in 2020 that's my opinion um, and I think it's drive also fantastic on the road. Um, if I have uh, to choice to 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 choice car in this class, probably I choose that one. Um, my my 
recommendation for you guys uh, if you have the money and you want to buy a cabriolet this will be the, the one of the best options so anyway um, beautiful car beautiful dashboard um, you can see there the design uh, of the new BMW BMW make big big step forward in 2020 and also with this new bmw 8 series um i think they did a great great job and i'm really curious what will come in the future i know bmw have the most beautiful uh, exterior design also i want to show you the trunk here uh, automatic lift gate in the trunk as well also you can see here the the buttons and also good quality right here an led light that illuminate in the night uh, the trunk and also another one uh, we have two uh, led lights in the trunk also some space in the left side where you, you find also the repair kit and medical kit under there very well designed here we have the 12 volt port a uh, nine here we have the from here you can fold down the seat so this is pretty cool that you can also fold down the seat this is really impressive so you can fold down the boat seat when you want to uh, carry long items uh, you can uh, fold down the seat and you can even carry long items there without any problem so also on the right side the same same thing and some space there and also here uh, it show it tell you how can you load your stuff under the under this plastic there and how the things working. Um, I think it's pretty big. It's really big. It's really long. This um, this trunk it's quite quite long, and you can put plenty of stuff in the car. Also the triangle it's right here. It's kind of deep trunk. You can see maybe 20 25 centimeter. Um, and yeah, that's it, guys um what can i say it's it has a lot of space there you can see for yourself pretty 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 big space um in the in the trunk anyway um i guess that was my review with the new bmw 8 series 2020 model guys i hope you enjoy it if you have question please ask me um if you want to see more of the new bmw uh, subscribe to my channel check out my other videos i have plenty of videos on my channel and uh, what can i say thank you very much for watching um, please subscribe and i see you soon in the next video bye guys